Imagine a city where every corner whispers tales of a glorious past, where art and architecture converge to create a symphony of beauty. That's Florence for you. A city that's a living testament to the Renaissance, Florence is an intoxicating blend of historical grandeur and contemporary charm. This is where Michelangelo, Leonardo da Vinci, and Botticelli once breathed life into their masterpieces, transforming the city into an open-air museum. Ready to dive into this treasure trove of experiences? Here are the top 10 must-visit spots in Florence, Italy. Starting at number 10, we have the Duomo, the Cathedral of Santa Maria del Fiore. The Duomo isn't just any cathedral. It's a symbol of Florence, an iconic landmark that stands tall and proud in the heart of the city. This majestic structure is a marvel of Gothic and Renaissance architecture, a testament to the artistic genius of its time. Highlighting the cathedral's unique features, one cannot miss its distinctive dome, a masterpiece designed by Filippo Brunelleschi. This dome, the largest masonry dome in the world, is not just an architectural triumph, but also a symbol of the Renaissance spirit. The intricate marble patterns that adorn the cathedral's exterior, coupled with the stunning frescoes that grace its interior, add to the Duomo's awe-inspiring grandeur. This grandeur is not confined to its physical attributes alone, but extends to its rich history and cultural significance. No visit to Florence is complete without marveling at the Duomo's grandeur. Number 9 on our list is the Uffizi Gallery. A treasure trove of world-class art, the gallery is a testament to the wealth and cultural influence of Florence during the Renaissance. It's home to a staggering collection of masterpieces, a testament to human creativity and ingenuity. When you step into the Uffizi, you're stepping into the world of Michelangelo, Botticelli, and Leonardo da Vinci. Michelangelo, with his expertly chiseled sculptures, captures the human form in all its glory. Botticelli, on the other hand, mesmerizes with his vibrant colors and intricate details. And who could forget Leonardo da Vinci, a man whose genius transcended the realm of art? From room to room the gallery unfolds like a storybook, each piece narrating a tale of its time. Whether you're an art enthusiast, a history buff, or simply a curious traveler, the Uffizi Gallery is sure to captivate you with its rich collection. The Uffizi Gallery is a must-visit for art lovers and history buffs alike. At number 8, we have the Ponte Vecchio. This medieval stone-closed spandrel segmental arch bridge gracefully straddles the Arno River. Laden with vibrant shops, it's a veritable treasure trove where you can find everything from precious jewels to fascinating antiques. As you saunter across, soak in the picturesque views of the river, a site that has inspired artists for centuries. A surviving testament to Florence's rich history, the Ponte Vecchio is an enduring symbol of the city's past. Ponte Vecchio is a charming reminder of Florence's rich history. Number 7 and 6 on our list are the Galleria dell'Accademia and Palazzo Vecchio. An integral part of Florence's illustrious art scene, the Galleria dell'Accademia is a must-visit for anyone seeking to immerse themselves in the city's rich artistic heritage. This museum is home to a significant collection of Renaissance art, but its crowning glory is undoubtedly Michelangelo's masterpiece, the Statue of David. Carved from a single block of marble, this towering figure stands over 17 feet tall and is a testament to Michelangelo's exceptional skill and the power of the human spirit. This iconic statue, which represents the biblical hero David, has become a symbol of strength and human beauty, capturing the essence of the Renaissance period. Moving on from the Galleria dell'Accademia, we now turn our attention to the majestic Palazzo Vecchio. This fortress-like palace serves as Florence's town hall and is a striking example of the city's architectural prowess. The exterior of the Palazzo Vecchio is an imposing sight with its crenellated fortress and soaring clock tower. Yet, it is the interior of this grand structure that truly takes one's breath away. The heart of the Palazzo Vecchio is the Salone dei Cinquecento, or the Hall of the 500. This grand hall, with its high coffered ceilings and expansive dimensions, was originally designed to hold the 500 members of the Grand Council. Today, it serves as a magnificent backdrop to some of the most important works of art from the Renaissance era. Its walls are adorned with grand murals, and the room is filled with statues, creating an overwhelming sense of the city's artistic legacy. From Michelangelo's David to the grandeur of Palazzo Vecchio, these spots offer a peek into Florence's artistic heritage. So whether you're an art enthusiast, a history buff, or simply a traveler seeking to experience the best of Florence, 
these iconic landmarks will leave you inspired and in awe of this city's enduring charm. Number 5 and 4 take us to the Basilica di Santa Croce and the Boboli Gardens. At the heart of Florence, the Basilica di Santa Croce stands as a monument of Italian history. Known as the Temple of the Italian Glories, it is the final resting place of many illustrious Italians. Michelangelo, Galileo, Rossini, and many more luminaries now rest under the church's stunning frescoes, making it a must-visit spot for history and art enthusiasts alike. Just a stone's throw away, we find the Boboli Gardens. A green oasis in the city, these gardens are an impeccable example of Italian Renaissance garden design. Behind the Grand Pitti Palace, the gardens stretch over rolling hills and offer a peaceful retreat from the bustling city. With its beautiful fountains, sculptures, and an amphitheater, the Boboli Gardens are a tranquil haven, a place to escape and immerse yourself in nature's beauty. Whether you seek spiritual solace or natural beauty, these spots have you covered. Number 3 and 2 on our list are the Piazza della Signoria and Palazzo Pitti. Let's start with the Piazza della Signoria. This historic square is the heart of Florence. Its cobblestone paths have been trodden by countless feet over centuries, each person drawn to the artistic and architectural wonders that surround this square. Here you'll find an open-air sculpture exhibit that's sure to leave you in awe. Each statue tells a story of Florence's rich history, a silent yet eloquent testament to the city's enduring allure. Then, it's time to step into the grandeur of the Palazzo Pitti. This Renaissance palace is a treasure trove of art, history, and culture. Its imposing architecture is a statement of the power and wealth of the Medici family, who once called this palace home. Today, it houses multiple museums and galleries, including the Palatine Gallery. As you wander through the grand halls and opulent rooms, you'll be transported back to the Renaissance, a time when Florence was the cultural heart of Italy. These two landmarks, the Piazza della Signoria and the Palazzo Pitti, are more than just tourist spots. They're a journey into the heart and soul of Florence, a city that has inspired countless artists and continues to captivate visitors from around the world. These landmarks are testament to Florence's enduring allure. Finally, at number one, we have the San Lorenzo Market. This bustling hub of activity is a sensory delight, brimming with color, sound, and energy. It's a place where the city's pulse can be truly felt. Here, you can meander through the maze of bustling stalls, each offering a unique glimpse into the gastronomic and artisanal richness of Florence. From the freshest fruits and vegetables, locally sourced and bursting with flavor, to the robust aroma of Italian spices and herbs, the market is a food lover's paradise. But it's not just about food. The market also houses a plethora of stalls selling an array of leather goods, from beautifully crafted handbags to stylish jackets. For those looking for a unique memento of their trip, the market also offers a wide range of unique souvenirs, each with its own story to tell. The San Lorenzo Market is where Florence's heart truly beats. And there you have it, the top 10 must-visit spots in Florence. From the majestic Duomo to the vibrant San Lorenzo Market, each offers a unique slice of this splendid city. If you enjoyed this tour of Florence, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video for more travel tips. Until next time, happy travels!